well aware not every single one of you all has the capacity to always be trading via a computer because the majority of people are at work or school most of the time. There is a solution though. It's the best mobile strategy for binary options trading. It gets you plus 80% to your deposit in one trading session. You're going to see it for yourself now. Hey guys, today we're trading via a mobile device. I'm well aware that the vast majority of y'all have neither the possibility nor access to your home computer or laptop to trade and do a proper analysis while you're away during working hours, for instance. Most people therefore use their phones and that's totally alright and there's nothing complicated about it. But it's one thing to place a trade according to complete and already made signal, it's very simple. All you gotta do is choose the right currency pair, expiration time, which is usually 15 minutes right and the deals direction there's nothing difficult about it you can actually don't even need anything beyond a phone on the other hand when you're trying to do full analysis attempting to trade via a mobile device by yourself i'm not in any way shape or form saying it's impossible or incorrect it's indeed possible you if you you don't know, have certain skills and the right strategy that would be enough for mobile trading so the thing about trading on the phone is it's way harder to evaluate the whole market situation at a global level along with using small and narrow indicators some data not really convenient either so today we're going to be using two indicators i mean it's actually one indicator we're just going to add it twice and that's our beloved moving average indicator let's leave the first line period at 12 not change anything and set the second line period to 25 so i'm entering 12 right here and the second one 25 we're making it also a bit bolder around two or three pixels and i'm setting the color preference to red so everything's great we added the indicator it doesn't take too much space in the chart but does in fact provide us with a decent range of information we can use for trading what do we know about the moving average indicator first of all the two indicators with different periods occasionally cross forming an intersection we may use as a signal about the trend change uptrend into a downtrend or vice versa downtrend to uptrend when the green line is located below the red one it means the current market condition is dominated by a downtrend in the opposite case when the green line moves above the red one an uptrend prevails therefore our today's task is to trade with the trend all the deals are going to be made with the trend the only nuances we're going to be looking for in entry points we can also use both the red indicator and the green one as support or resistance lines as those are pretty common period settings used by lots of traders moreover we can use intersections of the two moving average lines as our signals when the green line crosses the red one downwards it's a signal downwards obviously and if it crosses the red line upwards it's an upward signal i hope it's clear most importantly make sure to pay attention to the way such signals worked out within the chart's previous history for instance we've just got this signal for example it has perhaps already worked off but but we can overall see the trend is changing additionally the price broke through the red line right here fell below fell back down to the red line for retest and resumed the initially intended growth it's a good signal for the chart to keep on rising so based on all of these patterns we can draw a conclusion that there is a nice opportunity for us to enter the market upwards now so without hesitation we're clicking the buy button today i want to try and double the initial deposit really curious if we actually managed to but i'll be glad to end up with any amount of profit anyway because even for me trading via a phone is something truly new today we only trade within a one minute time frame i mean the deal is expiration time is set for one minute and the candle time frame is there by one minute just as well basically today we run the analysis within the same time from as the deal's duration the first trade has closed in profit let's look for the second one to work with according to the same script so guys another intersection right here this time the green line has crossed the red one downwards can kind of 
diving below the ladder. And that means the downtrend is to be continued. The only thing that slightly bothers me, we can place a horizontal line over there and notice the support level, meaning the chart might display a reaction to this level. So it's now very important for the deal to have enough time to close in profit. The overall case looks pretty much all right, although the price did try to slip and rise. However, as we can see, it eventually fell below the red line, which means seller forces are pushing the market stubbornly, which means the downward motion keeps going strong. Really has a situation we're witnessing as we speak. Hopefully the deal succeeds to close it at the right moment. I'm not sure if it has enough time though. If not, unfortunately the price bounced from the support level let's go ahead and place two extra deals i think these ones gotta get us profit for sure although here's the thing if we had been a bit farther away from the area that prevents the chart from falling we would have definitely managed to profit off of the first trade with no issues whatsoever So as you can see, the Martingale strategy yields the desired results. The series of three deals turn out successful and we get the profit. We did also get a reaction from the support level. So let's find and switch to another trading asset. So guys, we're placing another trade. The signal might be a nice one because after the trend, that chart piece right here is in such an active phase of the uptrend by the way and at the moment the price is touching the fast moving average line it's not like we can expect a strong reversal or a full uptrend sequel but we might at least get some kind of a reaction so it would make more sense to place a deal with an expiration time of around 30 seconds or so nevertheless hopefully the one minute trade with place will get us profit just as well this green candle of a decent size seems to be forming it will be done in like 10 seconds and we will finally get our profit let's wait amazing well as i've already stated trades open with a perspective for a tiny simple chart reaction are better off with a shorter expiration time literally like 20 to 30 seconds that's more than enough if you enter the market meticulously at the exact moment when the press is touching the line now the chart will supposedly keep moving towards the main red line and perhaps resume its upward motion afterwards let's see how it goes so we're getting ready to make another deal probably as soon as this candle right here is done for me the two lines will cross let's wait yep wonderful the lines have crossed the green line crossed the red one downwards to be exact and that means the uptrend is morphing into a downtrend so we're taking a vertical line highlighting the entry point just for convenience purposes we might as well check the last signal real quick let's see yeah not the best outcome out there well hopefully this deal works out although there was the sideway motion before i want to remind you all you shouldn't trade with a trend indicator during a so-called flat a sideway motion period of the market since as you can see there is a bunch of intersections however they are literally useless so we gotta look for situations when the trend distinctly changes from rising and into a fallen one or vice versa those are the cases when the chart gets to float below the two moving average lines for a while and then moves on to crossing them such cases create really incredible signals for us to safely enter the market I hope it's clear now. Here's another intersection we may enter the market with, but look, there's no signs of anything even somewhat similar to a trend morph. The whole situation looks like a sideway motion, so in this case, I abstain from taking a risk, not gonna place any trades. Just a little advice for y'all, avoid these kind of layouts. Such an interesting upward motion is soon to be expected, so I've placed a one minute upward trade during this tiny corrective retracement if we take a glance at the chart's history, we can realize it's been moving very gracefully. It moves with 
these swavish motions, one line occasionally crosses the other one real smoothly, which is stably followed by a trend change. So I believe the current deal is totally great. To sum things up, what can we highlight? I've already managed to increase the initial deposit more than twice, which is I, I can't help but celebrate, you know, because we traded by a phone the whole time, which is not anywhere near trading using a computer way, way harder. So as you can witness on my visual example, even as little as 15 minutes of trading can increase your deposit by 100% and more by yourself. And if you're looking for a less complicated way of making money, I would of course recommend you to trade according to professional signals that I provide if you're using your phone simply in order to avoid making countless mistakes due to limited capacity for autonomous trading. The link to my signals are going to be waiting for you below this video. Make sure to subscribe. Don't forget to share this video with your friends. See you very, very soon.